What's happening, my fellow gamers? Might as well call me 101. I've used that as a handle before. Got a little quick one for you here. Right at the very beginning of your playthrough, if you circle around behind Megaton, you can find this hollowed-out rock. Did I... Did I lose? Here it is. <laughs> you can find this hollowed out rock with a sniper rifle and a stealth boy and a few stim packs in it. And if you've been following along with me here on the channel and you're doing a similar playthrough, if I've inspired your ravenous hunger for fallout and you've decided to pick up the game again and you've got a a squad of your own started up and you want to put them in all you want to put them all in power armor but you don't necessarily want to be the brotherhood of steel in your playthrough You can see I've got everybody dressed up in the outcast, but that's just because black and red, Angry Joe, and I'm doing my Tunnel Snakes playthrough. But if you want generic power armor that just says power armor, so that you're not affiliated with the Brotherhood of Steel or Outcast, the power armor that you get from um, the Pentagon, if you've been watching my videos, or any Brotherhood power armor, you do this really early on. Take over to take over to Rivet City and sell it over here to Flack and Shrapnel, and come back in a bit, and he will have generified it for you. So that it just says power armor. I haven't gathered enough of these suits yet to outfit the whole squad in it. But there you go. This would have been more useful in New Vegas where, where it really actually mattered. But in case that's something, because that kind of bugs me, you know, in case that, that, that's something that's been bugging you in your head about the power armor situation. There you go. Non-faction affiliated power armor for you. Well, hope you enjoyed this quick little video. Like, subscribe, all that great stuff. Got some more stuff coming. So stay tuned. And have a great night as always.